There we go. What's up, y'all? I just don't feel like setting up my camera and mic, so we're gonna use a phone, which my phone takes a pretty decent. Also, I look like shit just because long day at work, long night last night. Uh, PSA. Always keep your standards up when you're out, y'all. Just do that. Ooh, excuse me. Also, I had to be working balls clock. Um, just chilling, not drinking tonight, just because, like I said, I had a late night last night. Um, I wanted to talk to my black friends, white people, you get a break today. Um, I'm gonna get really tired of holding this phone, I can tell. But, something I've noticed in black communities, which are gay members, gay, transsexual, which are like shit. People who date outside the race... We treat our women like shit. We gotta stop. Like, straight up. Like, I mean, you're entitled to your opinions, but I think I posted this about this on Instagram. The hotepery. Where these dudes are just so Afrocentric to a fault. And it's conspiracy theorists. Like, they basically can go around and talk all kinds of shit and just say they're being pro-black. And then call you not pro-black. If you happen to think differently. Like for me, I don't care who you marry. I don't care who you date, who you love, you know. Consenting adult, that's all that matters to me. But Hotep's, which I'll leave a link about what a Hotep is in the description from The Root. Um, really good news website, good article run by black people to kind of teach you things. Which I read it all the time, I follow them on Twitter, it's great. Um, Hotep's a guy who's woke, but he treats people like garbage all the time. Um, this video is not going to be long because I'm kind of going off the fly, but um, Hotep's, they're ashy, first of all, which I can't say anything, I'm looking like butt cheeks today. But um, Hotep's going around, basically, I'm wearing a white t-shirt, I'm following white supremacy. It's that kind of nonsense. Like, they won't call, they'll call out racism, which is good. But at the same time, they only like other black people who think just like they do. They suppress the women. They think a woman should be silent and, you know, bear children and that's it. These kind of misogynistic beliefs that come up out of the hotups, um, really hurts the cause. And I know personally here lately, like, I've been a big social media activist, but I want to do more. So I'm looking to get involved in local, like, there's a black college right by my job. I'm going to go check that out. My arm is getting tired holding this phone. I don't know why I thought this was a good idea. But because I was too lazy to grab the camera. Hopefully pictures will be up on Instagram this week. There's a music festival in Columbia, the January Music Festival. Columbia people, check it out. It's like, starts at 12, goes all day. It's free music. You can't beat that. Anyways, but yeah, black people, we gotta get together. We gotta, you know, we say we're for the cause. We say black lives matter, but we have to include all black lives, I think. And maybe I should have blogged about this, but I kind of like talking, talking it through a verbal processor and internalizer. I do both. But um, I think we ought to come together. Like, we gotta pull it together where... You know, Black Lives Matter includes gay black lives, transgender black lives, black women, more importantly, who have always been on the bottom of the tone pole. It's awful. The bad thing about these... Do I want to use the N-word on my new videos? That's another video coming up, but, um... These Negroes, I'll say that, um... They just suppress women. They treat them wrong. You know, they only... Basically, if you took a Trump supporter but made him black, it's a hotel, essentially. An Afrocentric Trump supporter. So, that's kind of what a hotel is. Um, yeah, I don't really have anything else I really want to talk about. It's just, yeah, if you're finding your wokeness, but it still includes misogyny, you might want to look in the mirror. They say feminism's destroyed the black community, but... You know, a lot of times because the men didn't step up, or, you know, black women have run a lot of things, yo. And these fools, they've pissed me off because their mom's a black woman. I just don't understand. But that's just me. Um, I'll try to do a real video later this week. I'm 
trying to make myself a better person, start exercising and playing music again. So, um, and do videos. I'm thinking about getting a PlayStation to start playing video games as a way to kind of cope and enjoy life and relax. So, we'll see about that. Um, if my laptop was good enough, I'd stream them, but, um, maybe I'll buy a new laptop. But, um, I'm really tired, a little discombobulated. I love you guys. You know what I say, uh, shit, peace. <laughs>